Hey, what's up guys? Today we're gonna be watching SpongeBob Sponge Out of Water. And if you want us to watch more SpongeBob, then comment down below what we should watch and get this video to 12,000 likes. And if you guys wanna see the full commentary track, then head over to patreon.com to sell the milk and give us money right now. Is that Patchy? Is that Patchy the pirate, bro? The goat? No, they had to retire him after he had the drunk driving accident. Oh no! Antonio Banderas plays the villain of this movie. F I completely forgot about this. Puss in Boots himself. Spanish people are not to be trusted, bro, so it makes sense why you would make him the villain. Yeah, Nickelodeon is spreading important messages to the youth. This is awful. This is not awful. Where's your fucking young joyous spirit? Are you so stripped of imagination? He was having fun and he was singing little tunes. Fuck you, I like this. He wasn't even moving against the spikes. He was walking in a straight line. That was like objectively a really shitty trap because there's just giant holes where the spikes come out and you can just walk around it. Oh my god, they got the fucking Aquafina. They got the Aquafina animated seagulls right now. Aquafina, shut the f up! Scuttlebug Squarepants. I'd watch Scuttlebug Squarepants. I'm not gonna lie. That show would be good. I promise not to sing. <clears throat> <gasps> What is that, Polly the parrot or whatever? Polly the parrot was a victim of domestic abuse. It actually is true, bro. Patchy was a fucking abuser. Why did they eat them for breakfast? Bubble bass. But even bubble bass likes the fucking food now. Well, that's because they finally got rid of the pickles. Dude, the fucking motherfucker on life support. <laughs> and the doctor's eating it too. Oh my god, the Plankton Blitzkrieg is about to begin. Tartar sauce. Dude, I used to say tartar sauce because Spongebob said it, bro. I, I used to say tartar sauce like every sentence as a kid. I was like, ah, tartar sauce. I'm not gonna lie, I feel like Patrick going into the military kind of makes sense in the Spongebob universe. Would Patrick even, ma like, hit the IQ cutoff to join the army? Oh my god, you're right. If Forrest Gump can join, anyone can join. <laughs> Trench Warfare. I didn't expect- I forgot this movie started with Trench Warfare. <laughs> it really does. They really were like, we're gonna make Saving Private Ryan for eight-year-olds. Did you see those prices on the drive-thru menu? You know the Krabby- the Krusty Krab still has the four for four, bro. Like, inflation has not hit this establishment. Excuse me. Shut the fuck up. Kill yourself, SpongeBob. Kill yourself, Sp SpongeBob. I was with you. I hope you lose this fucking war. I hope you get shell shock after this and trench foot. I hope you get PTSD and you have to go to years of therapy to try and solve it, but it's never going to be solved because war destroys human beings. Even sponges, too. Well, it's going to take a lot more than mayo to stop. <laughs> That was the first sound effect. <laughs> no way they used the reverb part! No fucking way! What the fuck is this movie right now? Something you can't resist. Oh, he has old tweets from Mr. Krabs. File jokes that fucking Mr. Krabs made 10 years ago. I've spent every penny I've ever made trying to put you out of business. Where has he made his money? No one buys his shitty burgers. Where does this money come from to begin with? Dude, he created the first AI girlfriend, and you think he's not getting fucking, like, checks in the mail for that? Join me! No! Never! I'm on Team Krabs for life! Team Krabs? They're talking about it like it's a shipping team. Team Krabs versus Team Plankton, bro. Who are you with? It's like, what, tw what Twilight character are you fucking? With. Yeah, well, Mr. Krabs is obviously Edward, and then Plankton's the weird one because, you know, Jacob tries to fuck Bella's daughter, so weird shit. <laughs> oh <my. laughs> it's like he's, he's intentionally making you more annoying. Plankton literally just is the parents who are all annoyed by SpongeBob. Oh my god, this is <laughs> SpongeBob's grip on children, on children's media, bro. like a little girl. Plankton actually got them this time, bro. It took him like 20 fucking years. My boy did it. I'm on Team Plankton now. I know he might be a fucking creep. He might have predicted the movie Her before it even came out, but like, my boy is good. So is he an anemone or a plankton? Well, 
Someone had to do it. Why was it Mrs. Puff? Why is Mrs. Puff there? I thought Mrs. Puff killed herself after the divorce with Mr. Puff. I'm not gonna lie, but I guess there's she's still alive, still kicking it, you know what I mean? She was the first MILF, if we really think about it. She was like my first crush. She was the first filth. She was the first fish I love fucking. So you've been running the long con on me, eh? Dude, Mr. Krabs has complete power over Bikini Bottom. Is there even like a society? Like, is there a mayor? He runs the only restaurant in this entire fucking town. He runs the only edible restaurant. Aren't you overreacting a bit? Oh my God, Mr. Krabs is sexy hot. That's hot. Now that is hot. He's in a gimp suit. This is cool. And kids are supposed to watch this gimped up? Gimped up? And then Bikini Bottom became all gimped up in their gimped suits. Are we gonna sit here and pretend like Sandy wouldn't be like the first one to be killed in, in like a reckless society like that? She Like she's basically the minority race in this town, you know what I mean? But she's also like the only person with a modicum of intelligence. And she has karate skills, like she's she's killing everyone. They're gonna tell her like, go back to your country, bro. But her country's Texas, that's the problem. That's, it's not a country. Sandy gets pregnant, but she can't get an abortion. So she went to Bikini Bottom, that's why she went to Bikini Bottom, so she can get an abortion. The lack of Krabby Patties has driven her mad. Sandy never struck me as the Krabby Patty type. I thought she was like a vegetarian or something, you know what I mean? Yeah, she eats like nuts and shit, doesn't she? You guys are just racist. Just because she's a squirrel, like, she only eats nuts, bro. Like, like squirrel lives matter, bro. It means it's the end! Okay, I'm starting to think maybe Mr. Krabs was literally putting drugs in the Krabby Patty, so everybody is having, like, withdrawal symptoms. Oh my god. Top five SpongeBob 9-11 theories you didn't think about when you were a kid, bro. That was, that's crazy. Huh? Gary's, like, opened up a brothel underneath SpongeBob's house, and he's selling snails for sex. <laughs> like, how much for one night, uh... Gary? What do you mean it's $30 a snail? They're fucking snails, Gary. I can pick one up and run away with my sponge between my legs. Good night, Plankton. Are they gonna cuddle to- is this like a homoerotic- This is a Brookback Mountain? Brookback Bottom? Which one would be the bottom here? I think SpongeBob, because SpongeBob has so many holes that Plankton can enter. He's entering one of them. Well, here goes nothing. I hate whenever they do this in Spongebob. Ratatouille. What the fuck is happening right now? This makes sense. This is Spongebob's brain. It's the fucking change in art style. Everything inside of his brain's in like a slightly different art style. It's creepy. This looks like Gumball. Oh my god, it does look like Gumball actually. What the hell? Nothing. Now go back to sleep. That shit was in his ass. That shit was in his ass. That shit was in his ass. Oh my god. But that came out real easily though. Like that just shows that Karen is pet him like all along we all knew it but the theory has finally been confirmed jack that's one minute of my life i'll never get back not without a time machine wait a minute oh yeah time travel wait there's time travel in this movie yeah 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 i'm pretty sure oh it's just like back to the future because he goes back and fucks his cookie mom she's a fucking scrub mommy thank you very much how stupid is plankton in this movie that he uh, 30 minutes in he's like oh yeah time machine is a pot like is that not like the first thing you would think of in this situation Oh my god. Oh my god. Ew, 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 why? <laughs> His body is fucking beautiful. Well, all bodies are beautiful, bro. That's what this show, that's what the, the, that's the point of this movie. Where is it going? Is it going in the Please. pants? Is it going in the pants? I think I see where this is headed. We need to, oh my god. He's been through my hard drive looking for the secret formula. He's been through my hard drive. He was digging through. Bro, Karen was raped. Dude, fucking who would have thought that Mr. Krabs is Griffith and fucking Plankton is guts in this bitch? Who would have fucking thought that that's how this movie would have ended up? What the fuck? Is this a Dong and Rampa execution right now? What the fuck is happening? This goes hard as fuck. Drugs. This is the drug scene. Oh, what year is this? It's Thursday. <laughs> <laughs> After all this time, he was able to keep track of what day it was, like, all by himself. That's fucking insane. That, that's the unbelievable part. All of his brain power went to that. My true name is Bubbles. He's the dolphin who, who censors the show whenever they swear, whenever it says the dolphin noise. Oh, 
no fucking way. Wait, actually? He's the one who watches. The number one SpongeBob fan is God, canonically. What are you doing? I'm watching. Oh! What? <laughs> Bro, I love that frame. That goes so hard. No, that's literally, you print out that frame. That's the type of shit that goes on a fucking SpongeBob bong where you're smoking the shit out of his nose or some shit like that. It's like, it's like you're wasting your life away always getting high. It's like, no, I'm watching. I am going to lose my job and you will lose your lives. His job was to watch Spongebob? That's basically our job. That This guy is basically us. We're a cool British dolphin? That's awesome. <laughs> that can shoot lasers out of our head. He was the one who stole the Krabby Patty formula. No fucking way, dude. He made IRL Krusty Krab. This is what I'm telling you. He played Puss in Boots. What does Puss in Boots do? He steals things. Rain down? Well, that's no good. How will I get me money? Mr. Krabs just every frame in this movie. It just looks like you walked in on him with his pants off. He's always like flabbergasted in that gimp suit. Has he even done anything since he got the gimp suit besides what he did to Karen that we can't talk about again? I figured out the solution. We just need to have hot, crazy sex while we're in these outfits. <laughs> oh! I'm not gonna lie. I do not remember the Squidosaurus. <laughs> Squidosaurus, run! This is like 10 different movies. It is a weird movie. Like, I don't know. The first one was very much more structured. This movie is all over the place, kind of. I'm just li I'm just listening to a League voice chat right now. There'd be a lot more slurs going on here, okay? He'd be calling him slurs for yellow people that I don't even know exist, okay? <laughs> How do they go back to normalcy after this arc? Like Mr. Krabs like destroyed Plankton's marriage and is about to kill SpongeBob. Oh Wait, what about all the other people? The main cast is coming, but what? They do not have enough budget to animate every CGI character. Well, they're gonna all die along the way. The entirety of Bikini Bottom's getting sacrificed. They're all gonna die. Okay, well I know which five characters are gonna make it to the top now because they were separated from the rest. All secondary characters come with me. Oh my god, <laughs> they, they literally it. said it. They literally said it. That's so funny. I like how Squidward just wanted to go with the secondary character. Like, it's so meta to the point where Squidward doesn't even want to be a fucking main character in the show. They're out of water! They're CGI! Literally, the la it's just the last 20 minutes that they're in CG. Maybe this guy knows where we are. He looks smart. Oh, the feet! Feet! Patrick's discovering his giantess fetish now. I think a lot of people watching discovered their giantess fetish. It's suffering, poor thing. He is right. That is a white person at the beach. So to a certain extent, there is a certain level of suffering. They're trying to save his life. <laughs> this is so just funny. Oh my God, they're going to push him into the ocean. They're about to drown this sad old man. He looks like Tony Soprano. They're about to murder Tony Soprano in cold blood. Whoa, whoa, immigrants. His parents have taught him to hate immigrants. Oh my God. I thought they were in California, but maybe they're not. Maybe they're not in California. Yeah, maybe they, they pulled up on Galveston, the nastiest beach on planet Earth. Squidward about to get horny, bro. And so is Patrick. What the fuck is happening right now? What the fuck? That's weird. Why is that more sexual than the, than the fucking tentacle creature landing on the woman in the bikini? <laughs> What the fuck? Squidward is fucking massaging, my boy. What? That kid did not- That kid did not speak! That kid did not say that. What- What did I just hear? That was the most dubbed audio I've heard in my entire life. That kid did not say Spongebob. That baby is voiced by Steven Hillenburg? What? Stranded on Pelican Island. I'm sorry, he- this man is just straight up God at this point? We thought we met God, we thought we met God was the dolphin, but it turns out Antonio Banderas got the death note and he can control them now. I think it only applies to the Spongebob characters, he can't, he can't just control anybody. He's got the Spongebob death note, the Spanish burger note. Since I found this old piece of paper! Oh, they can control it. They ripped the piece out of the Death Note and they could rewrite it too! It's gonna be super power! 
Superpowers. <gasps> Marvel! Marvel! And Plankton's gonna be like, and Karen gave me Slappy Tappy in the back of a Hummer. Yeah, is he just gonna wish for his wife to come back to life? Like, honestly, I don't blame him if that's what he's gonna write. Yo, awesome! Oh yeah, I totally forgot about this. This was also all over the marketing. And it's like the last 10 minutes. Those are the epic rap battles, guys! Those were the epic rap battles of his- Is SpongeBob gonna challenge Antonio Banderas to a rap battle? Huh? What? Ah! Oh, killer, bro. Run her over. I want Sandy to become roadkill, man. I just edited a cutter out <laughs> of the video. I don't want to see it. Do we ship them? Do I ship them? No, I do not. No, I do not. Earlier in the movie, Squidward was like being held by Sandy in such a cute way. And now he is riding her. I ship them. <laughs> Patrick asshole reveal? He's gonna see Patrick star. Patrick was, they could have beaten him right there, but Sandra was too afraid to see Patrick star. Think about that. <laughs> Yo, if you pay attention, you can see that all the cars are, like, old. They, they look like old, like, 70s cars. Does SpongeBob take place in the 70s? And we just don't know. That is my theory. That's an interesting theory. So you're saying SpongeBob could have stopped 9-11? SpongeBob takes place before 9-11. So did he cause it? Prepare to be teamworked. Okay, Cord, would you let SpongeBob in this body version, like, would you let him top you? Like, be honest. He's hot. He's, like, so built. He's looking like Clark Kent, bro. Like, he's got that top-heavy build, man. Oh, my God. Dude, the glasses probably, like, cut these people's faces up. <laughs> yeah. It cuts back. They're, like, covered in, like, blood and, like, shrapnel. This is, like, some Final Destination shit right here, bro. Oh, I remember this scene. But what about when all the bubbles pop and there's someone under each of these cannonballs? Will they die? Will SpongeBob cause a genocide? They will all die. This is like how in like Eastern Europe, there's just tons of fucking landmines in the ground. Like these are just problems waiting to happen with no good way of defusing them. Whoa! Oh my God! Hassan, that's Hassan Piker. Holy shit, they made him into a real person. That's actually real proportions too. Plank ton, they did it. He's like, yeah, I'm something of a socialist myself. They've been talking about teamwork this entire fucking movie. They're fucking superheroes. They're getting 1v5'd by one Antonio 50-year-old Banderas right now. They have not exhibited teamwork a single time in this movie. But it's time. It's time. The teamwork is finally gonna happen. Are they gonna kick him? They're gonna kill him. You killed Antonio. You just murdered- They killed him! No, Squidward. You're a cashier. What? You're ruining his life. No, you ruined his life. You're just, that's so sad. I left you a little surprise under your shirt. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. Squidward finally gets a W. See you later, TM8. What about Karen? Where's Karen? Is Karen still dead? Karen died, bro. Karen fucking died. Karen is canonically dead. Dolphin versus <laughs> And then it turns into like a trap like remix. You're an inferior species. <laughs> yes! Get fucked! Oh my god! What this is so out of place! This doesn't make this doesn't fit in with it at all. It just it comes out of nowhere. Alone up in space! Yeah, that must be off. <laughs> They're roasting you. <laughs> Who won? You decide. Comment down below. Who do you who do you think won? Dolphins or the or the birds? That was a strong eight out of ten movie. I don't care what anyone says, bro. Yo, if you guys want us to watch more SpongeBob stuff, they get this video to twelve thousand likes and a huge thank you to our page with the page. Like, Alejandro Paredes, Asmus Bioga, Atomic Leon, Bento, Kamlu. Communism is when people's iPhone, Cosmic Dega, Crystal Bunny, Daryl Herb, James, Frozen Spaghetti, Gabriel Granados, Gub Stargazer, Gummy Brain Rot, Gunny Snow, Jonathan, Helio. I love spilling the milk. Isaiah Alfred, Kamui, Night VDB, Lilac Moon, My Artist. Master Nate, Misty Skies, Nate of Obama Gaming, Omega Waffles, Puffles, Remuel, and Steven Sanchez, Terrence Sills, Useless Grunt, Val Explicit, Wyatt Lime, Yahir Sanchez.